Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, SciTech. In this video, I'm going to the speed test comparison between the Diamond City 9000 processor versus Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 processor. So this is a quick speed test comparison between these both powerful processors. And right now, this is from the OnePlus Nord 3 versus OnePlus 11R device. Let, let's do the side by side comparison regarding the speed test comparison. And this is my day one of using this uh, OnePlus Nord 3 device. And in case if you are interested in more videos on the OnePlus Nord 3, try to check the links in description and follow my channel for more information and try to go to the playlist section and there you will be able to find the oneplus nord 3 playlist videos and oneplus 11r playlist videos as well and right now all the apps are completely clear from the background RAM management everything as you can see friends everything has been cleared and now let's do the speed test comparison between this both phones and now we'll try to see which phone has got what type of speed right now this is a quick uh, speed test let's start at same time so one two and three so this is a quick speed test comparison between the OnePlus Nord 3 and the OnePlus 11R. So Dimensity 9000 processor versus Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 processor. And this is a quick speed test and let's find out which phone will be able to open this PUBG Mobile game faster. And the first phone to open the PUBG Mobile game is the 8 Plus Gen 1 processor. It did open slightly fast, 21 and 22 seconds, only one second difference is there. And now let's do this test for a second time. So this is the second time of me doing the test comparison side by side. So Dimensity 9000 versus Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 processor. So I'm not using any high performance mode right now while doing this testing. And you should be able to see the results which phone is opening at what speed. And Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 in 17 seconds. And Dimensity 9000 processor is taking slightly more time close to 23 seconds of time. So now let's use the high performance mode and let's see so will it make any kind of difference using the high performance mode or not between these both phones. So right now all the apps are completely clear from the background time management now let's see so using with the high performance mode between these both phones and I am trying to do the test again. So in this way, we'll try to find out high performance mode. Is it impacting any kind of speeds or not? So right now, I don't see any kind of speeds improvement, even using the high performance mode. So 18 seconds and OnePlus Nord 3 took about 21 seconds. So which is not bad. So meanwhile, signing off friends. Thank you for watching. And this is a quick speed test comparison. And most of the time, the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 was able to open faster with consistent speed times most of the time meanwhile signing off until next of more updates and bye